Bonjour Normandale fourth grade parents. I am Kanisek and I would like to introduce you to um, one of the tools that students will be using this year. It's called the agenda. It contains a lot of information and it goes home every day and comes back to school every, bit, every day. So I would like to introduce it to you so you know how your child should be using it at home and at school. It's called the agenda. So mon agenda in French. It will contain all the weekly homework assignments given to the students. They will copy it on the agenda. It will have their French spelling words, a list of French spelling activities that they can do at home. They will choose one activity, complete it at home, and turn it in in class on the spelling test today. And uh, um, there will be French and English reading logs in the agenda. Please note that parents need to sign the reading logs every week and uh, time test progression so that you know which test your child finished and which test they need um, to do next time for the for the time test the math facts and there will be there are there is also space to write activities that they do outside of school so this is what the agenda looks like mon agenda normally your, ch your child should have their name here their number in the classroom and the name of their teacher in the second page, when you open the agenda, it has a letter to the families and a list of 13 spelling activities that the students can do with their French spelling words. Students need to pick one of these activities and turn it in um, on the spelling um, test today uh, at school. So they can choose any and they can even make up their own if they don't like any of the 13 listed here and they will just turn it in in class on the spelling test today. The third or fourth page of the agenda is this. This is all the spelling words for the semester. So all the spelling words are listed here and we will tell the students the test date so that they write it here and they will know which day they need to do their test. One uh, mistake that students make a lot is from on the first, the first list is here the second is below it and usually students move over here to do it and this is really the fourth one not the second one so they need to move down in order to have the correct list for each week so these are all the spelling words for this semester because they will have two agendas one for each semester of the school year so this is what the agenda looks like inside with um, Every week we have the days of the week in French. Here is where they will list their homework assignments for the French class. And uh, um, English homework doesn't change much, so usually they don't write it here because English homework is just the spelling and the reading. And here students are asked to put activities that they do outside of school, like piano lesson. Then they plan their week. So this is why this is a really important tool for students to be organized. They will put here all the activities they do outside of school so that they can see, easily see which days they are more available to do more homework. So on Monday, I just put here a sample um, writing from a student that would say piano, spelling, 30 minutes of reading. Tuesday, baseball, 30 minutes of reading, two math pages. Wednesday, 45 minutes of reading, spelling, put spelling activity in backpack because usually we do the spelling, the French spelling test on Thursday. So they have their spelling activity on, on Wednesday in their backpack ready to be turned in in class on Thursday. And Thursday after school, they'll do two pages of math, 30 minutes of reading, play with Eric, my friend Eric at his house. And uh, Friday, 30 minutes of reading. So this is just a sample, but it shows students how they should be using um, this page of the agenda to organize their time and their activities outside of school. And uh, Saturday, Sunday, they can also write things that they do outside of school. The next page here is the reading log. So we have two reading logs, one for French reading, one for English reading. Parents do need to sign the log once students have done the required 60 minutes, which is a minimum students should do for French and a minimum for English. If they read more, that would be even better. 
So every day they will read and uh, log their minutes here and then their total for the week at the end of the week. And this is the grand total they've read. It's fun to just keep track of all the minutes they're reading during the school year. And then parents will sign the log before um, the homework is due and uh, students will bring it in class to get credit for all the reading that they did. And this is valid for French and valid for English as well. And the, the last page of the agenda is the time test progression. So this tells um, parents the four required um, uh, time tests for the math facts that students need to pass before moving on to the challenge tests here. So it tells you how many problems on the test and how much time is assigned to it. And then students can just use this as a reference when they are practicing at home to know how many minutes they need to spend on each one. When students have 90% or better, they move on to the next test. So that's uh, where they need to write their scores so that parents can see uh, their progression um, towards the next test. And if they have 90% here, they will automatically move on to the next test. So that's the agenda. It's a very useful tool and uh, we are hoping that this will help parents understand how students need to use it. Thank you.